boom, Bitcoin, it's back up again, back above 19,000, 19,191, which is pretty damn good for Bitcoin. Uh, it's clawed its way back. You can see here over seven days, it virtually has come right down. We bought the bottom, bought the dips, bought the dips. We talked about that over the last couple of weeks, buying the dips when we're in this massive uptrend. And then uh, she's reclaimed the 19,000 mark and hopefully we can keep pushing through. Everything's starting to come back up. Uh, Ethereum hasn't really popped just yet, but it will slowly come back up. You can see here Tether is down a little bit. So everyone's pulling their cash uh, back into Bitcoin. They're all FOMOing in. So these little dip buyers is what you really want to be in. So you want to be in the dip. And then you can ride this nice four and a half percent ish, and then you, know, you can take your profits on top of that. Chain links uh, up a little bit as well, but not too much. So it's looking good. Now let's have a look at the big dog right now. Big dog has come back up, and it's still in this this trend line. So we'll talk about this in our last video as well. And it's bounced off this, put in a nice little double bottom. So. It was the measured move off this triangle, but it's come around the, the end of the triangle. So it's a busted triangle and then it reclaims on top of this trend line. So it is reclaiming the top of this trend line at the moment, but it could get rejected here. So watch out. But this could be another little dip by down here is around, around the 18,000 mark. And it's got the good support with the uh, 200 as well. Histogram is maybe going to roll over you can see how long here it was pegged up there as well so it could roll over uh our rsi is looking pretty reasonable coming up to the overbought zone and this is on the four hourly and we've still got a bullish macd cross so uh, everything's looking half okay for bitcoin at the moment but make sure you're taking your profits if you did buy down here and got a nice little dip buy and you've got four percent that's pretty damn good uh, at the at the moment in the market dominance let's jump over to dominance we've pumped up a little bit got above the 200 so we're looking pretty nice there as well so we're putting in low high low high 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 uh, higher low and then we put in another higher high so there's a small little uptrend there for the dominance as well so it's one to keep an eye on and it was banging on that resistance now we've got Ethereum. It's putting in a small little double bottom as well on the four hourly. So if you can hold above this level, maybe retest down here at 571-ish, uh, then that would be a half decent spot to jump into. And then hopefully it can ride back up. But we have to make sure that it hops back into that channel, doesn't hit this and is a bearish retest. But if it gets up here, uh, we'd be pretty happy as well with Ethereum. It's got a nice bullish MACD cross. It's trending up ways on the histogram. Uh, we could watch out maybe for a little pullback on the oh, on the histogram and it's trending up ways on the RSI. So that's not too bad. Uh, total 2 is looking the same. It's kind of working its way up, bouncing off the 200 here. If you were to draw that little line there, uh, let's do that right now. We'll draw us a nice little, nice little line here. And... It's probably working its way up here as well. You could probably see a, uh, a reasonable trend line there. So you can see that one. That one's probably better. It's got more touches. So it's coming up and it's going to get to the top of this trend line in a, in a little while, in the next couple of probably hours. And you will see maybe a little bounce back to the bottom or we may see some money flood into the market and push this altcoin market up, which is what we want. We love alt season here. Uh, it's not looking too bad on Binance. If you're not on Binance, you've got to get on Binance. Binance is the place to be. Click on the link in the uh, description section and you can see here, it's not a, it's not a good day, but uh, a few of these are starting to run. We'll have a look at Koti coin in a minute. It's, it's got a pretty nice chart actually, and has some big news coming up as well. I've talked about Koti before. But there's not much really happening in this space with the uh, with the altcoins at the moment. Over to a little bit of news: MicroStrategy strategy completes 650 million bond sale to finance next next Bitcoin purchase. 650 million people want to buy is how much they've raised for buying Bitcoin. So it's huge, and I also seen just a few minutes ago a. Uh, 
a little article from Grayscale buying another 130,000 Ethereum, I'm pretty sure. I will check that and, and post it on the uh, Telegram group. But man, I meet Everyone is getting into Bitcoin crypto. It's going to be huge. It's going to be massive in the next few years. Uh, Cody Coin, here we are. Here's our nice little chart. So we've got a small uptrend, uh, not a small one, but a reasonable uptrend uh, forming. So you've got your low, your high, your high, low, high, 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 uh, low again. And then hopefully we come up and touch this trend line. A break out of that would be magical. And it could come back down, touch this trend line again, and then keep going. But it's looking good. Cody coin is looking good. It's not buy now. I wouldn't say buy now. You'd be coming down, want to test the 200 again would be nice. But um, it's got some good long-term potential. You've got this nice rounding bottom as well. And you can see here that on the 31st, so on uh, New Year's Eve, you've got Global Trust System launch, CVX platform launch, Cody Pay debit card, Testnet 2.0. You've got Cody Pay iOS, Cody Pay Cobra 2.0, Mainnet is coming, DAG 2.0, oh, Cody Pay, <laughs> Cody Pay DeFi integration. It's going to power at some stage and it's going to have a fair bit of hype behind it. All right, if you like what I'm doing, give us a like, give us a comment and subscribe. Thanks.